Trotters for the fifth race lined up for the SBOA final. Here they come. They're off and trotting. First off, the Wings Major Muscle down the center, joined outside by Danish Darby. Up with them third, Celebrity Eventsy. And back to fourth goes the favorite Caprice Hill. Fifth from the rail, Timel Tempest. Six trots up, Dottie. Seventh taken back, Flowers and Songs. Final three are Moonlight Cocktail, Yangon and PL Jill. Into the opening turn on top for Bay Arshon. It's Major Muscle, who's on the muscle early, clear by three open lengths. Trotting in the pocket spot from the second, Danish Darby. Right with them third, Celebrity Eventsy. And the quarter speed was right. Rock solid as 26 and 4 speed flashes up. A gap of five lengths back there to Caprice Hill from and forth as she's content to go along at her own clip. We've got action up front. Celebrity events. He's on the move out of third. Filion shows her the whip and shows her open road as she'll brush from third to first here in the second quarter. Back in the pocket spot second. There trots Major Muscle. Danish Darby. Awful gated third inside. Stays up with them up to the midway point. The field is by the midway point in 55 and 3 and they trot towards the next turn. On that lead it's still Celebrity Eventsy, pocket sitting second, Major Muscle, Danish Darby still ill-gated third, outside from in fourth now, trots up Caprice Hill, on cover, Timel Tempest is fifth now, sixth inside to Flowers and Songs, outside Dottie, third over from in seventh as the field travels up to three quarters next, and it's Celebrity Eventsy, on top a length and a half, second is still Major Muscle, Caprice Hill inching closer, third outside, they're at three quarters in 124 and two, Waples pops the plugs on Caprice Hill now, and she's got lots of work to do if she wants to get to Celebrity Eventsy. Celebrity Eventsy comes into the stretch. Back in second, Major Muscle. Caprice Hill goes to work now on the outside. Flowers and Songs is powering through now. And look at Flowers and Songs with that white blaze coming through for McNair. She's full of trot and she's upset-minded to the tune of 23-1. to 1. And Flowers and Songs, the Red Seas, part for her. And she'll win the SBOA stakes here. 153 flat. Back in front of the grandstand with the upset here in tonight's fifth race, the Wag SBOA to Flowers and Songs, three-year-old Dewey Cheatham and Hal Philly, out of the Wind Songs Legacy Mare Pleasures Song. Homebred is owned by Bob Key of Leechburg, Pennsylvania. Winning trainer Paul Reed, the winning driver Doug McNair. Flowers and Songs picks up her sixth win in 12 starts this year, and despite that high win percentage, she got little respect on the tilt board, 23 to 1 upset for the six Flowers and Songs with a 153 score here tonight. A stakes record performance in capturing the SPOA stakes. Tammy right McNiven presenting the hardware. Happiest spot on any racetrack, and uh, no different tonight. Paul Reed joining us from inside the winter circle. And uh, did you think you were going to be here at the end of this race? Oh, uh, no, you always learn to hope, but <laughs> tough competition. It was, you know, like I said, you wish you could get there, but it's the, with Caprice Hill in there. It was, I know she had her work cut out for her. Playing the role of giant killer, I mean, things worked out really well. I mean, down the stretch, the seas parted, and she oh. came right on through. And Dougie gave her an awesome, dri awesome drive. I mean, he's been getting along with her great. It was just, uh, it, was, it was fun to watch. Last year didn't race as a two-year-old, but obviously she's making up for lost time. Already now a six-time winner in 2016. Lowers her lifetime mark by nearly three seconds. Yeah, uh, she got hurt uh, after a baby race as a two-year-old, and uh, Rich Gillock brought her back this winter and did a great job with her for Mr. Key, and uh, we're just happy to have her. It actually is three seconds because it was 56 and one. <laughs> now it's a stakes record time of 53. Uh, where do we go from here? Uh, she's fully staked, so we'll see how she goes. Um, she got the gold series, and she has some stakes in the, over in the States, too, so we'll see how she does. Congratulations on this win. Go enjoy it. Thank you very much. Trainer Paul Reed uh, pulling off the huge upset in the first SBOA trotting final, 23-1. to 1. Sounds pretty good. Yeah, Flowers yeah. and songs getting it done.